Right, good morning and welcome to Conkers here in Moira is the official postcode, but it's kind of just out of Burton again, a bit like the National Forestry Centre. So I've never been to Conkers before. This is our first park run. You can see lots of people are congregating. And the good news is to start off the day, it looks like it's free parking. Woo! So we have a special guest with us today. Here's Miss Claire. Will you be, get, will you be get, getting a... Uh, personal best today no no <laughs> how long is it since you've done a part run it's about three weeks but the problem is look i do have a problem with my knee today okay I, look show the people my bruise oh yeah how have you got that bruise i don't know i think the kids give me up <laughs> <laughs> she works in a nursery right let's go and find the start brief it needs to be that'll be great uh, if you do want to slow down, down the flag over there, we stand by that flag. Um, there's usually more, more uh, ambassadors than me. I'm, I'm the sole one here today and a bit crippled, so I'm not running around. Right, so we're now going to the start line, which I'm not sure where it was. How are you feeling? Are you ready? I'm tired. You ready to watch the railway tracks like it said? I'm ready to get special tonight, but... Right, you are you impressed with the walking group? I would like to have that in my Hackney Park Mart run, where yeah. literally I nearly got trampled. <laughs> impressive. Yeah, there is a little bit of a small funnel that we're entering now to get to the to the start line. Right, we're crossing the first train line, so this is where he told us to be careful. Right, you can see they've got the minute signs out. So, are you gonna go forward? We'll do our quick selfie before you go to your stop. Look how organized they are. 50 minutes, 30 minutes, 20. Yeah, my dad's been coming a lot longer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's Right, so the bell is now ringing to say that we're starting. And here we are at the back with the end trailers. Let's go. We're off. Yes, we're off. We're off. We're off. Gradient, it looks like we're going up and round. All right. right, so we are half a mile in, and you can soon see that it definitely is a old railway track that we're going down right now. Right well, now it looks like the, the leaders are overtaking us now. Here's number two. So good news is we're gonna see Claire in a minute guys. Well not in a minute, in a couple of minutes. Right so it's 9.18. We've just crossed our one mile point. And so we've got lots of runners coming back now. I did wonder why a lot of these runners were out of breath. It's because the gradient is going down for us. So easy for us, really hard for them guys coming back. But for us, this is lovely. Nice downhill walk. We're gonna see Claire, I hope, in a minute. I think we're approaching a loop point. Oh, I'm hoping we're not gonna miss Claire. Okay, now I'm regretting enjoying that downhill because what goes down has to come up look at this so it looks like we're going to loop around to where we've just come from there's a very tempting little shortcut then but we went up we're following the course 
the good news is we're going back down now. You can hear them. Right, we've got another little uphill. I'm turning right. Right now up here we're up here we're going next to the canal, which is nice. So coming downhill, we've got the halfway point. Right, we're coming back through the tunnel, which means the finishing line must be close. That was a start point. Oh, we can see the end. <laughs> right, looks like it's a long finishing line. This is our long funnel. <laughs> right, we've just finished our 5k. How was that for you, Claire? I'm going to tell you, I had an injury, people might know, um, but I literally found it quite tough. It's quite endurance because you're going up and down, up and down, up and down. Um, the only other thing I would say that some people were in the wrong area, so it made my time a little bit slow up because I couldn't pass them because they had their children and they were walking. Which is quite ironic because it was the most organised park runners that they had 40 minutes, 50 minutes, yeah. 30 minutes. People can't leave. People were just not in the right area. Mm. But still, it was a, it's a gorgeous area here in Conkers. And what are you looking for now? Two. No, you're looking oh, for Conkers. Conkers, Conkers. <laughs> Let's find Conkers at Conkers. You come in the centre, the cafe is just down here where we can sit outside. And uh, Claire is outraged right now. Who's I just, you? We came for chestnuts or something. Those <laughs> chestnuts, pine cones. I don't know. But the park run I did last week at the National Forestry Centre, yeah, it did have conkers there. Gonna so we're going to we're going to go there now and get some. Conkers. No, first we're going to eat. Yeah, let's eat. Enjoy sitting outside. Oh, there's a craft corner out there as well, don't. So we fancied a good uh, breakfast, so what we've done, we've just raised uh, through Moira and found that uh, all the park runners seem to come to this Eden Bistro. Claire found it. Claire found it. Let's go and see what breakfast delights. We want protein guys, that's what we want. So we're here sitting outside the Eden and we've just found a, a remarkable breakfast idea. Breakfast pizza. Claire. Do you fancy that idea? I would normally, but I'm very hungry, so I'm going to have the big large breakfast. Right, so she's going for the large breakfast. Super healthy salmon, look, with avocado, scrambled egg and chocolate. But I think I've just got to try it, haven't I? Breakfast pizza, it's got to be done. Never even heard of it before. Right, so here we have the baked bean pizza, which is actually quite meaty, saying it with just baked beans. And here's Claire's big breakfast, which actually looks big. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel and you can download my free diet plan at jodybunting.com. Please give us a like, a comment and a share.